On June 15, 1944, a World War II Hellcat fighter plane took off with 23-year-old Navy Ensign Harry Warnke on a training mission. He never returned back to the airfield that fateful day. More than 60 years later, a recovery team takes a five-minute flight from the Honolulu airport up 3,000 feet into the fog of the Koalau mountain range on Oahu. Once at the drop-off point, they clip in and hike 30 minutes on slippery terrain to reach the crash site. Once there, JPAC team members from all four branches of the military dig, hoping to find anything that will positively link this crash wreckage to Ensign Warnke. A dog tag, bones, teeth, possibly even a family photo. Marine Captain Alexander Vanston is on his first mission with JPAC. The biggest uh, piece of the puzzle is going to be finding the cockpit, and that's where we think we're, we're kind of in that area right here. There's just a lot of dirt to remove so we can get down to it. Teams dig up the mud and wreckage by shovel and hand, battling everyday challenges of the slippery slope and ever-changing weather. 60, 70 degree slopes and uh, putting in a lot of safety lines. Uh, also, <laughs> as you can tell, the, the weather, uh, it's been a weather issue back and forth, but we work through it every day and do as much work as we can. Now, during most JPAC missions around the world, team members are able to excavate the site and then sift through the dirt on site looking for any remains that may be found. Well, up here in the Koalau Mountains behind me, you can see this site's a little different and a little too muddy to do that. So what team members here have to do is pull tarps around all the dirt, then nets, and then have helicopters come in and sling load the loads all the way to Schofield Barracks here in Hawaii. Here, deep in Army training ground on Schofield Barracks is where the recovery mission shifts to something else. The operation in back of me is the uh, soil drying and screening operation. The Schofield team receives the packages of mud, spreads it out for drying, then examines it closer. I'm looking for anything that's not dirt or rocks or weeds, anything that can place our person in that aircraft when it crashed, you know, is important. JPAC's slogan is, until they are home. And every day, teams like these are in the ends of the earth doing just that. The first time we found remains on one of my sites, I didn't, I just cried. I didn't know, I don't know how to explain it. I just cried. Myself being a ground soldier, that if something were to happen to me, somebody would be coming back to bring me back home, that one way or another, a soldier's going to get home. Marine Sergeant Jeremy Vaught on the Koalau Mountains, after one of America's finest in Hawaii.